poles of a magnet. Let us know what are the poles of the magnet. Spread some iron fillings randomly on a wooden table. Take a bar magnet and hold it horizontally from its center. Bring it near the iron fillings and move it around. We observe that the iron fillings are attached to the two ends of the bar magnet. These two ends of the bar magnet are called poles of the magnet. Point to be noted is that all iron fillings are attracted towards the poles of the magnet. The reason for it is that most of magnetic strength of a magnet is concentrated at its two ends that is poles. Let us learn how to determine the poles of a magnet. Take a bar magnet about 25 centimeters long. Tie it at the center with a long thread and suspend it from a stand as shown in the figure. Allow the magnet to come to rest. We notice that the end of the magnet points in north-south direction. Disturb the direction of the magnet and allow it again to come to rest. You will observe that the ends of the suspended magnet will again point in the north-south direction. From this, we conclude that a freely suspended magnet always tends to orient itself along a north-south direction. The end that points in the north is called the north pole of the magnet and the end that points in south is called the south pole of the magnet.